Hey guys, it's Rob J here, and in today's video I am bringing you the second part of my sort of what's possible with the Ant Kit Starter Kit Zero. Um, so basically what I'm doing is finishing off my um, decorations. So in the last video I used PVA glue to attach a layer of sand to the bottom of the art world so basically what I'm doing now is I'm using my makeup brush um, I really can't stress and recommend you grabbing yourself a set of makeup brushes um, because you can get them from a pound shop for a pound for about six different sizes and they are a godsend cleaning up out worlds um, this doing this sort of job when you're building out worlds it, they're just fantastic, a must for all ant keepers. So all I've done is brushed it all the loose sand and any sand that would have come loose in say the coming months has all been forced loose by me now. Then I've drained it and if necessary you'll get some sand dust uh, on your window, on your side of your tub. So all you want to do is just wipe that away. If you have any bald patches and there's no real reason to be worried about that because it's a see-through bottom but if you don't want it just add a bit of PVA glue to that one spot and sand that one spot but as you can see I'm just tidying up my plants and that the sand dust generally dulls down the greens and uh, your colours of your rocks etc so you just want to prep your outworld really and um, this is just essentially to show you what you could do with a starter kit um, and this is me now using the starter kit you know how it's intentionally meant to be set up so there's my test tube for my queen and you know let's pop in my uh, my food dish in a second so let's pretend I've just prepped something onto that and in we go You know, and when your ants have outgrown a test tube, you can just attach something like a size 4 nest to it. Now I've installed a expansion port. And you don't have to put yours on the side, you can put yours on the back piece. You can do what you like. This is just an example. Hope you've enjoyed this sort of content. If you do, be sure to hit that like button. And if you're not already, why not head over and hit the subscribe button to not miss out on any of my different varied content. Thanks a lot guys and I'll catch you next time.